Hey, this is Shar and this is an unboxing video. I think in my previous video, I did mention that I'm going back to the Philippines in a couple of days. And while I'm there, my sister and I were going to Cebu. Oh, eh. <laughs> and um, so I think it would be great if I buy a sports camera. I bought the sports camera for less than $120. Wow. And it includes everything. So this is that unboxing video. So let me just go get the box. <laughs> inside the box okay there are some papers here some pictures i think like what's inside what i can expect to get you know it's all it's all in chinese so there are no use to be but the, but the pictures help so i'm going to keep this one for later there's this box well there's this bag here and let me open this bag first there are tons of other things inside Ooh. <gasps> yay wow they arrange it for me that's so great by the way this is not a gopro this is a local brand i think so this is what it looks like so you have your camera here this is the camera this is for diving these are some brackets some clips this we have the gorilla stand the one that you can attach to your body the one that you should attach when you go to swimming the bag that contains battery charger data cable and yeah okay this is for the clip that can attach your phone to the selfie stick and this is a clip that goes with the gorilla stand okay that's all they arrange it very pretty so there this is the camera the sports camera the brand is the brand is 4k ultra hd 4k 4k yeah okay so there's there's this one and there's another one maybe i think this is for the underwater I'm not so sure, but I do think this is for the underwater. This one. Oh! It's also include this. It's like a selfie stick. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Stupidity. Okay, it's like a selfie stick for the sports camera thing. I think this is for this. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Okay, I also have this. What's this called? The spider thing? I forgot what's this called. Oh, this is for this. Okay, so I can make it stand. have this thing i know this thing because i saw this in their website okay this thing should hold your phone and then you should connect this this thing to the selfie stick like this it should be like this okay and then you can use it and then you can 
attach your phone here and then you can see what you are filming because the screen of the, the uh, sports camera is not that big so you can use your phone to connect it via Bluetooth or Wi-Fi I'm not so sure but there's an app for this thing because I also researched it before I bought it this is not like somebody sent it to me I bought this online so I researched how to use this first okay so this is pretty cool I like this maybe I can also use this for my videos Oh, there's a separate bag. Okay, this separate bag. Let's see what's inside. Oh, that's cool. Oh, what's this? Oh, it includes a shutter for turning it on, taking a video, and other things. There's also a spare battery, a charger, the USB cord. Oh, it includes this clip. Maybe, yeah, it includes this clip. You can use it for some tables, maybe. I don't know. Sorry. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to research that later on. Okay, I also have this. I'm holding it wrong. Okay, I okay, also have this. This should this should go on your body and then you attach your sports camera here and I also have this for your head this for your arm and a lot of things okay so that's all for the bag okay so <laughs> th that's all for the bag okay hold on there's more in the box I also have this. This is for diving. So your camera can float. I think. I have never owned a sports camera before. Okay. There's a bag here, a black bag full of these things. This is for cars. Okay, this is for the car. If you want to use your sports camera as a dash camera, then it's fine. I know this for a car because there's some like white thingy, white transparent thing that's supposed to stick on your dashboard. Okay, there's one more thing that I am very, very excited about and this product cost me $60 is pretty, pretty expensive for me at least. Okay, so this is Sports X1. This thing, this thing should um, make your sports cam very stable and not very shaky when you're shooting things because this is really a sports camera and you know sometimes you need to not be shaky so that your video is very good right so okay so this is like that I forgot what's this called the guy the seller told me the, the seller told me what's this called so it So I'm guessing you need to charge it. I need to read the instructions first before <laughs> before using these things. Okay. So connector, charger, connector, USB, USB connector thing. Okay. Oh, I finally found it. Ah, finally found the manual. Okay. So in the manual, there's some product descriptions of what you should get so according here i should have okay so i'm going to read this and this also so i'm i think this is very worthwhile you know for $120 sports camera is pretty good. This sports camera should be HD, like 1080 HD. <laughs> so let's see. Okay. Hey, are you in HD? 
So let's see. Okay. Hey, are you in HD? <laughs> Okay, so that's I'm going to show you what's the difference and then according to this manual it should be able to shoot up to 19 minutes because I think I think I can insert an external PS card I should be able to shoot more I'm not sure but right now I insert like a 32 gigabyte PS card and I don't think I'm going to use it that much because I'm just going to use it in Zipu to, you know, to to document the things that we're going to do because this is the first time that my sister and I are going to travel together. Yay! Um, also, the resolutions, the resolutions of the photos are 16 MP, 12 MP, 8 MP, 5 MP, or 2 MP. Battery battery capacity is only 900. Well, that's that's fine because I have a spare battery. And charging the battery takes like two hours according to this. You can use this in different languages. There are English, simplified Chinese, traditional Chinese, Korean, Russian, French, German, Italian, Spanish, Portuguese, Japanese. So I think this is pretty cool. Um, so because it's only less than one hundred twenty dollars, so I think that I really did a good job. That's all. And this is all for the unboxing video. That's all. Hope to see you in Cebu. Bye.